r slash am I the asshole. AITA for telling my parents I won't drive my brother to school unless he is more hygienic because his smell literally makes me sick. Judgment, not the a-hole. I'm a high school senior and my brother is a high school freshman. I have a car that I brought with money I'd save from work and I pay my own gas. However, my parents pay my car insurance, so they said that driving is a privilege for me, not a right. They said I need to drive my brother to school, even though there's a bus. And the problem is that I get motion sick easily, even when I'm driving. Too much driving makes me vomit, and bad smells when I'm in a car makes me feel ill too. I'm not exaggerating, I've always been like this. As a kid, my family couldn't go on vacation without me puking at least once, I always make sure I know where my bath bag is on the plane. I always used to take motion sickness pills, but I'm not allowed when I'm driving because they make you tired. Anyway, I can handle the drive to school on my own fine, but when my brother is with me, I literally feel so sick because of his B.O., even with the windows on my side open. My friend told me I should make a checklist of what my brother needs to do before getting in my car in the morning. Have a shower with shampoo and soap, brush his teeth, put on deodorant, wear clean clothes, including underwear and socks, and remember to use shoe antifungal spray. Right now, he doesn't do that. He likes to sleep in to the last minute, skip showers most days, picks clothes up off the floor to wear, skip brushing his teeth, etc. So I did that and told my mum and dad that I couldn't do it anymore unless my brother had done the hygiene list in the morning. Either they could check or I would and they blew up at me, saying that I was being nasty and humiliating, that if I wouldn't drive my brother, I couldn't drive. Then I said, fine, I'll go back to riding my bicycle to school or getting a ride from my friend. And that caused a big fight, because I guess they were not expecting me to call their bluff and give up driving. AITA for what I did, 